Well hello everyone and welcome back to another video and it's going to be a bit of a wet one today <laughs> yeah because I've uh, decided to come out on the day with the worst weather typical British rain and it is absolutely lashing it down I did want to do it yesterday and I didn't I've been wanting to do it all week this go out on this little car camp and there's been you know reasons why I haven't been able to go and I should have gone yesterday I wish I'd have gone yesterday I decided I'll do it today and now as soon as I got in the car it hammered it down so yeah let's go and see what happens I've just stopped off at a local Audi though to get my dinner I was going to cook some salmon and asparagus tips for later I don't know now because I'll have to see where I get to if there's any shelter I don't know I don't know what I'm going to do yet but it is going to be one of them I'm just going to do what I need to do and hope for the best. Let's go. <laughs> Look at the weather. <laughs> it's absolutely lashing it down. So where am I going? Well, I decided to go to the Cotswolds. I thought, yeah, let's go to lovely picturesque Cotswolds. And we can go for a little walk and, you know, explore the area. Yeah, well, I don't know I'll be doing that now. I don't even know I'm going to cook my dinner in this weather, <laughs> but you never know, it might stop by the time we get there. So let's go and I'll see you when we're there. Well I think this might be it, but I'm not sure. But it looks uh, doesn't look very flat. I think we need to go up here and have a little look. Well, I found this little spot that I was looking for. It's not too bad, actually. I've got a bit of shelter from the rain because, look, I've got the trees above me. You can probably hear the rain, but it's not too bad down here. It's sort of, no, it's not soaking wet, put it that way. So I'll park there and it's a lovely little location. Look, look at all these trees. So I've got a bit of cover in. So I might just be able to get my dinner cooked after all. I'll just get a little seat here. I should be able to cook just there, really. I really need like a little wooden board, really. I could have just, I could have cooked on here, couldn't I? Anyway, we'll see. We'll see how it goes. Losing the light fast here, and the rain's coming down pretty hard now as well. So I've got to get this done quickly. Pop support on. seat's wet as well now it's really coming down now yeah. 
Got my little camping lantern. Try and get some light, just so you guys can see mainly. I can see all right, actually. Although, that does look pretty dark now. But yeah, what we got? Got some asparagus tips. And two salmon fillets, red tie inspired. Whether you can see that or not, I don't know. There you go, you might better see it now. And we're going to eat both of them. Possibly. Probably will, actually. I need to go and get some oil. I had that little bit of oil, I wasn't sure if I had some or not. Let's see if I can get these salmon fillets on. I can even open them. Why are these things so hard to open? Doing it in the dark, in the rain. Yeah. This isn't going very well, is it? I can't even get this open. Oh, that's impossible. Let me go and get a knife. Finally found it. I can't see anything because it's dark. Right. I didn't really want to cut that inside the car either because that's going to stink. I need to get a bag now for this. <sighs> well, it's not looking too good. I've burnt the bottoms of the, the salmon because the pan was obviously too hot. Can't really regulate the heat on these jet boards, really. A little bit, but you can't turn it down; it just turns off. God, it's really coming down now, the rain. Yeah. I couldn't have picked a better spot though, I don't think really, to get some coverage. The way it's raining, if I didn't have them trees, no chance of doing this. No chance. And it would have been super noodles. And I was really looking forward to this, so I really wanted this. Bit with the light there, isn't it? Put the light up there. I forgot my um, my little tongs. I got these things. I bought these a couple of years ago, and I really don't like them, but it's all I had, so not have to do. How are these asparagus tips looking? Yep. That's looking nicely there. And that salmon looks about done. 
I think we're there. I think it's time to plate up. Question is, can I get the uh, salmon out without losing it? That's it. She took the jet board off first, didn't I? That didn't look too bad actually. It'll do. The, the salmon's probably cooked a bit too much, but no, it's just a bit crispy on the top actually. No, that's 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 bang on actually. That's perfectly good. Yeah, it's just how I like it. I like it a bit crispy. <sighs> right, I'm going to get that eaten. <laughs> it's like the Blair Witch, isn't it? <laughs> it's a bit dark over there. It's a bit dark over there. All of a sudden it looks scary. <laughs> I've just got all my light here and then I looked out there and it's pitch black. I can't see anything over there. Look. And there's the ground. Yeah. There's a tree. Right. Well, I'm going to eat this. And then I'm going to get ready for bed. And I think I'm just going to get, <laughs> I'm just going to get in there and settle down for the evening. I don't even know what time it is. What time is it? It's not even late. It's like seven o'clock. <laughs> I'm thinking about getting to bed. I don't normally go to bed till like twelve o'clock. Oh well, looks like I've got lots of stuff to watch. Providing I've got a signal, I haven't even checked that. So but I'm going to eat this before it gets cold. So I'll catch you guys in a minute. <clears throat> Wow, that was so good. That is a definitely a goer from Aldi. Yeah, toy inspired salmon fillets. Absolutely gorgeous, that was. I had both of them, went down a tree. Asparagus tips, yep, lovely, absolutely beautiful. We'll definitely have that again, so I highly recommend that. So it's clean up time now, and uh, yeah, might have a cup of tea, I don't know. Hmm. What should I do? I don't know. Mm, cup of tea, I think. Right, I'm in bed far too early. It's, it's like quarter to eight now. <laughs> and I'm, well, I'm not actually in bed, bed. I'm just sort of like lying on the top. Because it's hammering down the rain, so. And it's all damp and horrible and yeah, even everything in here is damp now. My coat's damp and my cap's damp and my boots are damp there in a bag over there. So yeah, I've got the windows on a little vent. I've got all the windows on vent actually. That one's on quite a good vent over there. And I'm just going to chill out and like watch something and um, get myself a glass of apple juice I think in a minute. I didn't even bring any snacks with me. Really? What did I bring? Nuts, I did. I did. I brought some Brazil nuts in a bag somewhere. I don't know where that is. <laughs> I've lost it already. It's got to be here somewhere. That's the thing. You lose everything in, in, in your car when you're like, trying to camp in it. It needs to be organised. Really, I should be in the van, shouldn't I, really? I've got no room in here, to be honest. I've got... Look, that's my headroom, look. I mean, I've got... You know, I've got that much headroom and I can sit up sort of that's that's about it I can just sort of sit up like that but you imagine trying to cook in here you can it's impossible really isn't it I mean I'd have to do it lying down that's not it's gonna be a disaster isn't it so this is the reason why I want to get my van done my caddy van I don't know if you probably might not have seen my previous video I just assume that you've seen my that you're a subscriber and you've seen my previous videos but you might not have you might be a new 
new subscriber or just a new viewer who has not even subscribed. And you might be watching this thinking, what's this madman doing? Car camping <laughs> in his car. <laughs> yeah, so if you didn't know, I've got a caddy van, a VW caddy van, and I did a wild camp in it a few weeks back to see if I could sleep in it. And I was thinking like, yeah, weather like this, that would be a lot better. It'd be a lot better to use than this. So, yeah, the van. I've got to get this van build done. So, fingers crossed on that. And hopefully that'll be coming soon to the channel. So, well, I'm going to get myself a little drink now and chill out. And I'm going to find something to watch. <sighs> Hello. You still here? You've made it this far then, have you? Well, I'm all cosy now. I've had a cup of tea. Just sitting, chilling in the back. Watching uh, a film on my MacBook, watching uh, The Secret Life of Walter Mitty. I do like a Ben Stiller movie, they're pretty funny. So I'm going to watch this, chill out. And uh, hopefully I'm ready to go to sleep after that. So yeah, look. Let me know if you've seen it. Let me know if you thought it was any good. And then after I've watched it, I'll let you know as well. So right, yeah, I'm going to get on watching this. I'm going to chill out. And I'll see you guys in the morning. Good night. Well, morning all. It's currently 7am. And I didn't sleep well at all. Yeah, just uh, waking up all night. And I'm sure this mattress has gone down. Um, yeah, it doesn't feel like it's got as much air in it. It feels a bit softer. And as I'm a side sleeper, my hips have gone through it. I can feel I'm pushing into the floor underneath. So I'm going to have to check this when I get home to see if it's actually leaking or not. And then sort something out because, yeah, I didn't sleep well at all. And then find a solution. Because that's, I think, the second or third time now I've had a bad night's sleep on this. And when I first got it, I'm sure, I, I was all right. And it was a bit cold as well. It wasn't too warm. This, this down quilt isn't that... Like what I've said in previous videos, it's just... It's not much good. And now we're in October now. So the weather's getting colder. Although yesterday, it wasn't too bad, actually. The weather, it was quite warm, to be fair. And it, I wouldn't have even said it was that cold last night, but yeah, definitely got to sort something out for the colder weather. So yeah, I'm going to get up and get myself a coffee and get myself some breakfast. I've had my coffee, just what I needed to wake me up this morning. I needed a kick. I was struggling to get up because I didn't have much of a much of a sleep last night, as you know. Didn't sleep too well. So I've got, got my coffee, got myself some breakfast now. I've made myself some protein oats. Just waiting for those to I'm just waiting for those to do three minutes with the boiling water. I'm gonna have those and it's still pretty wet and miserable. It's stopped raining, it's drizzling a bit. I'm debating on whether to go for a walk. I think there's some walks around here and I could do with going for a morning walk. So I may do that. And if I do, I'll take you with me. So let's see how I feel after this. and see if the rain holds off.
Well, I decided to go for a morning walk. It'll be a travesty to go to the Cotswolds and not actually go for a nice little walk. It's warmed up a little bit now. It's not as cold as it was. A couple of degrees warmer. No idea where I'm going. I'm just going to find my way. I'm sure I've seen some walkers over there. I think I heard some people walking with dogs. I'm assuming there's a, an entrance up here somewhere. Let's have a look. Yeah, it's a bit muddy. But lovely, lovely countryside. And I think the footpath is this way. Yeah, here we are. Lovely footpath. Ah, this is what we want. to go now. Hmm, let's go and have a look down. Let's go and have a look see what's down there. Actually, I prefer a woodland walk. I'm going to go this way. I do love a walk in the woods. I would say woods are my favourite place. Forests be even better. I love it magical about it I don't know what it is maybe it's just that connection to nature that we all should have and don't always have looks like somebody's built a little shelter at some point well <laughs> tried to should I say what have I found bed in there. <laughs> this trail obviously cuts back on itself from the road. I had a feeling it was going to come this way. So when I heard things go bump in the night, <laughs> Probably was things going on in the night in here. <laughs> and I did hear stuff when I was cooking. And I was sitting outside. I could hear things rustling around and moving about. And I didn't know though that there was um, a footpath running alongside the road. <clears throat> I doubt there was people though at that time of the night. I didn't see any torches or anything. You wouldn't be walking in the dark, would you? So let's see if we've got any views. <coughs> Looks like a little path going down here. I don't know where it goes though. Oh yeah, we do have some views, although it's a bit misty. Can't really see it. Yeah, let's go this way. Reaching in the gate, I think. Oh, 
it's rather slippy. Oh, yep, it is quite slippy. Oh. And it looks like we're back on the road. Back on the road again. Yes, I can hear the song coming into my head now. Pretty sure that car was there last night when I drove down here. Could be wrong, but maybe they stayed over as well. It's a lovely little road though. I do love these roads that cut down through the trees down there. Nice little walk in the morning, this. Oh, I think I'll better stand clear of this one. Got a bit of a big truck coming. There's a bit of a big puddle. Hopefully it won't get wet here. <laughs> Big stinky farm truck. <laughs> oh yeah, that's uh, that's a whiff and a half that is. <laughs> right, can I get through the middle? Yeah. I think this is a good place to end the video. I've had my morning walk now managed to take you along with me the weather did hold off for a little while it's warmed up slightly it's getting a bit warmer even now I'm a bit too hot hopefully it'll be nice today you never know with this weather in the UK one minute it's cold and wet and rainy next minute it's sunny <laughs> and warm so yeah hopefully you uh, enjoyed the video if you did give me a thumbs up and uh, subscribe to the channel because I will be doing more videos and that really helps helps with the uh, algorithm thumbs up and a subscription it tells YouTube that people like what I'm doing so and then that encourages me to keep going so yeah I will see you guys in the next one see you later